Hello, hello. Welcome to the first one of these we've done for a while. It's an open Smash Arena. Namely because I usually uh, join in for Wickersham's Smash streams every Friday. He streams Smash around this time. But uh, he's not able to this week, so instead I'm going to host my own Smash stream and hopefully we'll see some of the same faces coming to join us. Why am I Krom? I, I must have been playing him for just for funsies. You know what? Let's have funsies. I feel like getting destroyed. See if we can get someone to join us. Xavier. I don't recognize Xavier. I don't know if they're from the usual uh, crew. It's a Greninja. Let's see what his Greninja is like. Hello, Darian. I got I got Lucina close enough. Ooh, hello. Get out of there. What is this connection? This isn't on my end, I hope. Usually, I have a, a, a good history of an internet connection for Smash. I have been having more cases of not-so-good connection lately. That lasts longer than I expected to. That was also stronger than I expected it to be. Are we good now? Do we have a connection? No, you. Hello? Them's looking like Pokemon Scarlet Frame Race. You like that? You like that topical joke? I got hi more highlights coming out today. And on the topic of uh, Wicker streams, I will probably have the yearly compilation of clips from his streams coming out next week. Happy almost New Year, everyone. Tis the end of 2022. We're celebrating with 22 frames per second. I'm not going to feel good about this, however it ends. I hope this Greninja knows that. Staying in front of him while he's charging F-Smash. That's a good idea. So, uh, I'll have to see if other people in the arena are having this issue. If it's gonna be the- I'll, I'll give Xavier a few more chances. If, if it's this way, like, for a long stretch of time and we get other players... I don't know if he's gonna be able to stay. Just run into that. Yep. Hail Mary. I, I went for it. I shouldn't have. Aw. Oh, F tilt was just barely too short. Yeah, counter. I need counter. I knew you'd do that. I hope someone else has joined. Please, someone else join. Oh. Hint. 
anticipated the spot dodge. Okay. Flag. Bullshit. I shielded. Who's the guy that is, like, infamous for that? The guy who just, just johns constantly. He always blames the game for everything. Dark Side Phil, that's what I'm thinking of. I don't watch him, but I, I am familiar. I've heard of him. I'm sorry if I'm being cynical. Wicker's not cynical. Three, you don't need this. Two, one, go. This is not a this is not a great way to open the stream. Is being stuck with one person with frame rates like this though. I'm just. When does the fun start? When do we get to the ride? Don't, I, I'm okay with Robin. Robin is very the center of the board for me. Lucina is a character that anyone can play. Which is to say she's a very fundamentals-based character. Like if you know the basics of the game, you can you can cobble together a, a Lucina. Just like one might cobble together his frame rates. Easy jokes, that's the order of the day. No. Yeah, throw it again. I forget how much drift she has while she's doing that. Oh, it crosses up? I didn't know that. What are specials, anyway? Who needs specials? I got a sword. I got an electric sword. She's gonna do it again. No, she's not gonna upbeat this time. My F smash is a faster at least. Oh. I I guess left myself left myself open for the rapid jab. I'd also probably be playing more impressively if I wasn't on random. I, I'll be the first to admit that. I was opening with some uh, some silly circumstances, regardless of how this went. Ah. Uh. Oh, that's right, I can do that. I forgot I had thunder. That's dead. No, not quite. Would have been a great time for a punish if the frames cooperated. And there's, there's, there's no... Man, you can't even punish that, the crash spin.
Mithra's the one with the unpunishable frame. The Not usually. I, I'm surprised when a move that uh, Pyra has is relatively safe. Do we have anyone else in the arena yet? We have Darian here. All right. I will give Darian and Xavier a chance to fight. Once again, if it looks as bad as it was for me, then uh, I'll kick Xavier. Three, two, one, go! That's not a great start. Not an auspicious beginning. I like how the game just, like, freezes for a second before every hit to really emphasize the impact of the hit. I'm making a joke about the lag, but it actually does kind of do that. I remember when uh, I first played this game compared to Smash 4. I don't want to call it... I, I don't want to call it less fluid because it's not really that. It's more that uh, momentum kind of starts and stops a lot more than it does in, uh, in Smash 4. In Smash 4, you get sent flying at a speed and you just continue moving that speed. And there's also not as much of the, uh... There is, like, a couple frames this game just kind of pauses on, uh, hit, hit stun? It's not really hit stun, but it's a different thing. But it does try to emphasize hits, whereas Smash 4 didn't really have that mechanic. So this is this is still looking pretty rough. I will uh, I'll, I'll remove Xavier from the arena and I'll do some friendlies with Darian until uh, anyone else would like to join. Yes, it is it has been this bad with every match with Xavier. I'm afraid four buckets. If you would like to join, you can use the command expl exclamation ID for the arena code. Darian looking like he's actually going to win this. Benefiting, perhaps, from playing a character that he actually mains. Imagine. Logically, Xavier should be winning. He, he has 32 more numbers than Gary has. There it is. Yeah. Die, monster. Hello, he'll... Hidal Hidago? Hildago? Hidalgo. I like I like the name Hidalgo. Welcome to the stream. Alright, uh, I am going to take a moment to remove Xavier, unless Xavier leaves himself. I don't think he's going to. Uh no, he left, okay. Code is exclamation ID for the arena code. Someone uh, posted it just a second ago. Three, two, oh boy. One, oh, I don't know go. how to Steve. No. That's okay. He's broken. Be gone. 
I'm just gonna stand back here. Yeah, boy. Camping. No, you can you come to me. Get out of here. I'm gonna play the only way I know how. Lame as shit. I'm gonna sword you. Ah! <laughs> this is the lamest match. I, I got pretty for, I got pretty good draws for my first two characters. I am okay with Lucina, and I guess okay with Robin. I, I didn't really get to play them, is the problem. Diamond. Yeah. Yeah, boy. Ah! Peak gameplay. I, I, I will switch to a character I actually play after this. Oh, I lost my diamond? I thought it stayed with me if I died. Yeah, Steve is in my, like, bottom 10-20% of characters. I can play a lot of characters in this game with a basic level of confidence. Steve is not one of them. And Darian, while not a professional at the game, is apparently good enough to counter my Steve. That didn't eat him. I'm out of iron. No. He's on. He's jumping the minecarts. What do? This was my only plan. Oh! Oh! I didn't want to do that. No iron. Steve without iron, bad. Hey, can I at least get one stock off of Darien? Darien, final boss status. Surely I can get like a bear or something. Or just another minecart, even. Yeah. Oh, it stopped going. Give me the gold tools. Yeah, gold sword. Death. I got three stocked. My Steve is that bad. There's someone named Yamamza Ho. What is she? Alright, there are people here now. I'm gonna switch to a real character. Please don't start the match immediately, or uh, it will not be on stream. Probably too late, because there's like a 20 second delay. Start with classic. Alright, there you go. Simon Belmont versus America. Let's go. That filled up fast. We got a lot of people now. music. This must be Final Fantasy music if it's on this stage. I considered making the arena music, uh, the, the, the Pikmin, just the noises. It wasn't worth the joke, though. Steve keeps the diamond if you don't craft. But no, I, I got the diamond first stock, and then I died immediately, and then I was back to wood stock too. Not that it mattered. I'm never going to learn Steve. There's very... I, I, I guess if you 
useful to know fighting Steve as well. I made it into tools. What? Oh, yeah, yeah, his inventory, the items in his bar don't go away. I know that, but his tools go away. That's what I was talking about this whole time. Anyway, stuff's happening. Darien, unfortunately, just uh, upbeat a little too far from ledge. You know what? If it was a character that I could effectively keep away from, maybe I would have at least not gotten restocked. But uh, against a Belmont or someone who knows how to be aggro, against Jack, I could have gotten away with Steve. Jack would just like stand back with Little Mac and wait for me to get like full, fully set up. restocked. You can do it. Don't go for the Randy up bees, though. You're gonna kill yourself again. You're gonna get flooded. This is even more hype gameplay than your mash. That's right. Nothing says hype like a Belmont. I say that. Uh, almost any character in this game. Mario! In my opinion. Then again, I don't really watch competitive Smash, so I'm not that picky. I, I, don't, li I don't like character bashing. I, I, I avoid character hate. Unless it's Little Mac. Little Mac deserves it. Four buckets and Sir Knight. You said Ready? don't up me, he down tilted instead. I, I saw that, that you were a shadow. This is a uh, slightly different version of the Thousand Year Door finale. I don't quite remember this outfit on either of the characters, nor do I remember it taking place in uh, the Animal Crossing village, but uh, I do remember something like this happening at the end of Thousand Year Door. I gotta get back to a Book of Mario 64. There's a lot of there's a lot of streams that I've been I've been putting off solo, namely that and Crash 4. I, I've been procrastinating on. I haven't done any of the I haven't started the next Trials game. Been putting that off for a while. And uh, the Ocarina of Time randomizer for this year is coming up. I got the. I wasn't able to get the multi-game randomizer working, but I was able to get the uh, the PC port working. So, uh, 60 FPS Ocarina of Time coming soon. And the PC port has a built-in randomizer, which is very cool. I'm, I'm glad the games are starting to do that. The ass is too powerful. Tis a mighty ass. Fear the peach ass. I wonder when I wonder when specifically the peach came to be associated with the ass. This this is an internet thing. This, this is like post internet. This happened sometime in the two thousands, I think. Historically, 
in, like, classical literature, the peach has been associated with the lady parts of the ass. It's changed. This is a very important thing to uh, moments in history. This is a history lesson, this stream. Oh, that was a funny nair. Oh, no. Okay, she made it back. That was Mario doing some weird hitbox shenanigans in order to hit his nair with his ass. I don't see a, like, a, a, a back of Mario nair very often. There's a Peach who knows how to move. I feel like I've seen this Peach before. I wonder if I've, uh, I've fought Sir Knight in the past. She knows how to, she knows how to do float stuff. I mean, I, I know how to float with Peach, but, uh... I don't know how to play like I, like I look like I know what I'm doing. I play Peach like a heavy, which is why it doesn't doesn't usually work. Alright. Moment of truth. Is Peach's mom a hoe? In all likelihood, she's probably a mushroom. I saw some, uh, some comic. Some post-Bowsette comic that, uh, posited that Peach was just a toad. Just a female toad. But the crown makes her look like this. Every night she takes it off and she just goes back to being a toad. Which makes as much sense as anything else in the Mario canon. Can't, like, there's a canon. Ooh, upbeat kill. Apparently, the Rosalina story in uh, Mario Galaxy 1 was uh, put in without... Miyamoto's permission. Like, he was just not consulted about that. And he apparently di he didn't approve. Which is not that surprising. But, man, come on, Miyamoto. I don't think he even changed his tomb after it turned out that that was one of people that... It, it, no one has ever said a bad word about that, right? The Rosalina storybook? Everyone loved that. I have never seen anyone complain about uh, having that Rosalina storybook and, and Mario having just a, a little bit, little bit of story. Is she a toad or a toadette? You know what, that itself is pretty vague. We got, like, female Toads in Paper Mario, but Toadette is just her own character. Hello, Lupus. Lupuse? Sir Knight is on track to prove that uh, his mom is not, in fact, a hoe. I eagerly anticipate uh, Wario's counterpoints. Oh, 
already tested this ahead of the time, but uh, I'm gonna ask anyway because I'm anal about this sort of thing. Audio levels sound good to everyone. Game not uh, drowning me out. Another upbeat kill. Wasn't Toadette from Double Dash her first game? It's the most, the rudest, most condescending Smash character. Wario's an asshole, but he's a he's a positive asshole. Look, he's even happy when his opponent wins. He's just a happy guy. Toadette was in Double Dash. You know what? That makes sense if she was invented for Double Dash, because the whole game's gimmick was that everyone was in pairs. Everyone needed a partner. She was in uh, Thousand Year Door. Not her first appearance. I'm pretty sure she was in some. She was in at least some of the Mario parties, but I don't remember which was her first. Ooh, oh, that's not good, Shadow. The frames. Save the frames. Wario is an herbivore, as you can tell from his wide, flat teeth. That, that, that's correct. He subsists on a diet of only garlic. Garlic and, like, cakes. I remember WarioWare games opened with him eating, like, cakes and candies and things. On the subject... Of, uh, Wario, not necessarily Wario where. Uh, Pizza Tower finally released on Steam. Which is a long, long produced spiritual successor to the Wario Land games. Ooh, that was a combo. Item combos. If there's, like, habits of hers that I can exploit, I'm probably going to get destroyed. I'm just happy that I won't have to fight in this connection. Makes it all the more impressive that she was able to do that combo, to be honest. Alright, who's next? Is it my turn? It was it was a very laggy match, and and it was it, it's your end that's laggy, Shadow. Sorry to say, your internet is uh, it's 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 going doo doo right now. Ready? All right, let's see how this goes. Who did uh, who did Peach start with? We have the same rule as in Wicker's Arena, whereas. Uh, if you beat everyone in a line and come back to the first person you fought, you go back to the back of the line. This is just so someone doesn't dominate the arena for two hours and everyone gets bored and leaves. Which has happened. Mm. A little bit of delay going on. No! Oh, that delay! Did not, uh... Did not tech the flame choke. It's not, it's not stuttering. I don't know where Sir Knight lives 
but uh, I, I think we're definitely far apart because there is a lot of input delay in this match. Which, again, makes the precision play all the more impressive on his part. Saying his because it's Sir in the name, I have no idea who this player is. to attempt out of shield. It wasn't really out of shield, but... Uh... Okay, she teched that one. Ah! I, I should have expected that. She's done that every time. Could be EU. Get out of here. All right. 20 to 0. Could be better. Could be worse. Ah! I don't know why I expect her to go below me. That's death. Man! If only Ganon could fly, I would have lasted in the air longer than her. Does Peach have no counters? Her neutral B is a counter. See? She has a counter. No, I, I don't know what her matchup spread is like. She didn't fight Darien yet. I don't really... Did a bunch of people leave? Is this all new people? Has everyone just been cycling out? I think she started with the warrior. She started with Yomama. She proved conclusively that her mama was not, in fact, a hoe. And, uh, Yomama's a hoe was not happy about that. And left the arena over the result of the debate. Well, if it is a whole new batch of players, then I guess she gets to keep going even longer. Maybe someone can beat her. Maybe someone can dethrone uh, Sir Knight. She's not unbeatable. I came. I came close. She's very technically proficient, but uh, she's also a combo-heavy player, playing in EU delay or whatever delay this is. And uh, she does. She does have habits to exploit. Ass is grass because of Peach's ass. Like poetry rhymes. Darian desperately playing keep away. Peach not having it. She's coming in for those combos. She's taking Simon for a ride, and there's nothing he can do about it. a very Link-like character, come to think of it. I mean, Castlevania and Zelda are very different games, but uh, I, it just occurred to me that they both have that archetype of like big, bulky, slow dudes with uh, just a huge arsenal of items at their disposal. Which I guess is, is Samus as well. Samus is just like space future Link. Item combos. I believe in you, Darren. You can get a stock. Hold on. Hello, Elf. 
We didn't have any players for a while. But uh, then everyone joined at once. And then they all left, and another everyone joined at once. So we're actually getting a lot of people today, it seems like. Genuinely feels like I'm playing a bot. She's, uh, yeah, very technically proficient. Don't let the mean princess lady hurt. Your fate is up to Sora. Can Sora defeat the darkness of Black Gold Peach? Aren't that at five in a row? If she comes back to the same person that she's already beaten before, then uh, she goes to the back. I think these are all new people, though, because she, she started with uh, the Wario, and the Wario left. I wonder if Sir Knight is in the stream. I'm gonna guess not. I feel like I know Sir Knight from somewhere. I thought so too, I feel like I'd played them before. Nice about going by any five consecutive wins, you get an auto message. I don't have any kind of bots like that. I wasn't aware that that was a rule that uh, other people used in their arenas. I thought that was just something that me and Wicker did. Oh, okay, you mean the, the in the arena, the Smash info box. I'll keep it in mind, but for the time being, I'm fine just, uh, I'm fine with it. I don't think that Sir Knight is necessarily in chat, so, uh, unfortunately, in all likelihood, they're not going to be aware of the rule, they're just going to keep going, and I'll have to kick them after they do their cycle. We got enough players now. Oh! Oh! Peach has gotten so many of those. Sora, usually I've never seen that, that kill off the top. Sora with a side B that high. That's silly. Why did she let that happen? Yeah, I don't I don't like it either, Lucuz, but uh, it's the lesser of two evils. He did it. That's a non-issue. Sora defeated the queen. Sora wins. How much delay is there? There was a lot of delay with the peach. It's, it's usually player to player. It's not by the number of people in the arena. But uh, I think the peach is not uh, American. Lapuz, you were saved from the peach. Do you feel good about this? You feeling confident? You're not a Sora loser. I, I see what you did there. That peach was impressive. I, I said that. She, uh, she's been uh, very consistent with her combos, despite the uh, egregious input delay. Lapis Lupus. Lazuli. Ladders. Lapis ladders. Going for that bear. Sora just kind of danced around him, as he does with big bodies. Lupus wants that suck. He wants that offstage suck. Just 
get right up in his face and up tilt. Is Sora good too? <laughs> he ate thunder. That doesn't happen too often. You know what? I, I wasn't paying enough attention to the last match. I don't have a frame of reference for how good Sora is. We've seen the Peach for like 10 matches in a row now. I almost, I almost beat her, but uh, I blame the, I blame the delay for that. Right into a dash attack. You know, Sora's recovery is very exploitable. I don't know why George Lucas is saying that. It's probably a thing that he said. I wonder who the most famous person who plays Smash is. Like, regularly. This is a huge game. There's a lot of people in the world who play it. Ninja. Eh. Yeah. It's possible. It's possible. It's like, uh... There's streamers, obviously, but, uh... Is Ninja better known than someone like Tom Cruise or LeBron James? I don't know about that. Death by Thunder. DDD going for them bears again. Is, is that his neutral game? I, li I like to I like to play around with DDD, but uh, I'm I'm not a professional. I just kind of Gordo and Fair a lot. Come on, you get one more stock. Lupus has got this. Goes for another dash attack. Unfortunately, Sora does any pretty much anything Sora does is going to send Gordo back. This seems like a, a very bad matchup for Gordo. Which is a low bar. It's such an awful matchup. I can see it. I, I don't see a whole lot benefiting DDD in that matchup. Then again, matchups aren't always obvious. I thought, I thought like, uh, I have fun fighting uh, Donkey Kong as Ganondorf, but uh, other Ganons despise that matchup. Ready? One annoying thing about being the streamer, as opposed to Wicker or someone else, is that... Uh, I can't. I, I ch I'd like to change characters pretty often, and I can't do that as much as I want to because uh, there's always the chance that they'll start the next match and we just won't see it on stream. Ooh, that's not great. Ooh, Dragonite is out of your end. Yeah. I play with Dragonite pretty often. Usually he's doesn't have problems. Someday when the DDs are in charge, all characters will be limited to using one projectile. Just be uh just be uh Nick All Stars Brawl. Where projectiles are basically useless because they're all catchable. Every single one. You can just grab it and hold it and throw it back. Someone's using Netflix. You know what? That seems probable. Probably got, like, family. Watching the 4K Jessica Jones. Oh, that's enough. The next Smash game should just be all DDD. No one else. It'll be like Street Fighter 1, but the only character instead of Ryu is DDD. Yeah. 
You can't beat perfection. I don't know what he sounded like in the Narbe's dub. I just know he was Texan for some reason. Weird character direction to go with King DDD. There was Texan DDD and there was Spanish uh, Meta Knight. And Kirby just made baby noises. Which, you know what? That sounds good. I appreciate that. I like the idea of a Nintendo cartoon where the protagonist just makes baby noises. Because that's kind of what most of them do. Alternatively, I can't wait for the, uh, the Kirby film where Kirby is voiced by Chris Hemsworth and he just sounds like Chris Hemsworth and he's not doing a voice at all. That's gonna be great. I, I was I was joking, the poos. That was a piss take at the Mario movie and Chris Pratt. Ready? Internet has been having problems recently. Do you have, like, family members using it? Because that's usually what causes the stuttering. Is, a uh, fluctuating network demands. Alright. Uh, after I lose as Ganon, I'm going to change characters. FYI. For, uh, anyone in the arena. Could be soon. Looking like it could be very soon. This is not a matchup I'm, I'm crazy about. Then again, I just don't like fighting Sora in general. Mm. Oh, I expected to cross up and I didn't. Not dead yet. Nope. Can't kill me. Ganon has an excellent recovery, didn't you know? Oh, that's gonna be it. Ugh. He interrupted my thing. I wanted to do that. Oh, he's only at... He's only like 30% though, that's not gonna work. He also like squats sometimes. I don't like how often Sora low profiles my stuff. Okay, take that one. Just like the Peach, it took uh, two times. <sighs> like that, see that low profile? You like that one? This Sora likes to, uh, he likes to throw out that side beat and just go for it. I have to play a very careful game, unfortunately, and he's got projectiles. Here, please let me hit him. Man, because I re-grabbed ledge. I, I would love to like hit that at like a kill percent, but I'm not going to. He's not gonna let me. Well, I got one stock. Can I get two? That's okay, I've been downloading him. Now he's downloaded. I got this now. I should probably be like SDIing or doing anything at all. Back off. 
Also, not just throwing out attacks because I can. That's a very bad habit. Get out of here! Little 14-year-old piece of shit. I should be a JRPG protagonist. Why don't I get to meet Mickey Mouse? Oh, I thought I had another jump! I got two. Hello, the egg. Are you the real egg? Like, for real? Alright, I'm going to change characters. Please do not start the next match, or it will not be streamed. I am the egg. And I am the walrus! Bring out the flag. Thank you. Oh, that's working out surprisingly well this stream. Usually we, mi we miss a bunch of matches because people start early. Rematch. Sora versus Peach. Three, two, On Yoshi's. I think I have all of the legal stages except for Lila in this in this stage list. Which that's fine. We don't need Lila. Ooh, reversal. I, I like doing that as me sword fighter. If only me sword fighter had Sora's nice fancy side special. Uh sure it's an open arena, feel free. Type uh, exclamation ID for the arena code. Egg. Hello, Ribbon. I'm fine. How are you? It just, it just struck me. Haley Joel Osmond is in a Smash Brothers game. The kid from AI Artificial Intelligence is fighting Princess Peach. Man, that's weird. That really is like the Chris Pratt thing. Peach barely avoided dying at 48 there, because this is Yoshi's. I'm sure that Sora Upbeat would have killed at that height. Isolette seems familiar. Isolette is new. I don't know if I've ever met Isolette. I feel like I've, I've fought Sir Knight before. In fact, I'll probably, like, go through my clips. And I'll see, like, a fight with Sir Knight. You know what? I can do that right now. Because I remember... Posting in the, uh, Illatox and Elf King Discord. A clip of me fighting a peach. And Illatox wasn't impressed, but I thought she I thought she was like very technically proficient, which this peach is very technically proficient. Sora won, again, by the way. Good job, Sora. Don't mind me, I'm just scouring Discord. 
Oh, hello, Isolate. <clears throat> that was my peach. That was not your peach. Shut up, Elf King. Y'all ready to start? Ready? I can't find it. I I know I had I know I posted about fighting a peach. Maybe if I go through the clips channel. Yeah, that won't take forever. Three, two, one, Do you all know about go! Peach's XXX? That's a thing. You can find a, a mysterious object belonging to Peach in Peach's bedroom in uh, Mario RPG. In Japanese, it was Peach's XXX. In English, it was Peach's question mark. Alright, this, this is gonna take this time. I, I will look later if I can find the, uh... Find my previous interaction. With a skilled Peach player. Wait, no. I found it. But it wasn't- I didn't clip it. I posted a, a, a link to a VOD, and the VOD is gone now. Man! I think I've had Sir Knight join my- join in my room before. Maybe they just, like, join Smash Arenas all the time. All the time. Maybe she's joined mine, she's joined yours, and she's joined Wicker. Wickers. That would make sense. stream archives, because the archives are now, and I'm going to look for the stream from that day. What was it? 8 2022 That wasn't that long ago. That was four months ago. Right after the, uh, the Majora's Mask multiplayer stream. Sora won again. Surprise. This is gonna be so dis- this is going to be so disappointing. Sora versus Morton. It was not. It was a different player. I am disappointed. It was a avocado nip. Was the other peach that I fought and was impressed by her proficiency. Three, two, one, go! Bomba Dash. Who's Bomba Dash? Were they in chat? 
We had a Bomba in chat, didn't we? Is it reused voice clips for Sora? Because it doesn't sound like his Kingdom Hearts 3, like, 20-year-old voice. Can't stand to not be doing something constantly. That's why I hate things like Slingshot. But Slingshot forces constant action. Like, it's because of Slingshot that you have to be active constantly. Granted, it's usually not in the in the favor of the person approaching the projectile user, but uh, they don't really have another choice. He's going for all- every time he goes for all three. That seems like it would be very exploitable. Maybe it will be now that I'm a faster character. That's what I thought. It sounds like his Kingdom Hearts 1 voice. Not not his 2 and 3 voice. Never did continue that, Kingdom Hearts 2. We're still in the middle of our uh, several year stream of Twilight Princess and also Sonic 06. Walk and shield is fine. No, it's not. Shut up, Elf. You like to keep moving and keep momentum. Play a combo character like Falcon or Falco. You're talking about uh, advantage state. Or characters who can keep a combo going for extended periods of time. I don't know if Captain Falcon is necessarily one of those, but I know what you're trying to convey. Bombadash actually with the advantage right now. Forty to one fourteen. We a lot of people today. I am surprised. Welcome to the stream, everyone. Glad to have you. Falco and we fit. Girly? Down. Nah, not enough. That does have a final hit, doesn't it? The drill. It's not like me swords down air, which just doesn't have a final hit. Is it? Things I know about Bowser Jr. The side B is broken, and the F smash is basically unpunishable. Also, Cannonball is the best projectile in the game. Obviously, bar none. No sarcasm. Definitely no sarcasm. Yeah. Take this. Yeah. Yeah. a final hit, but it's very easy to fall out of it. That makes sense. Sora has brought it back. They're both at a at kill percentage by now. Well, more so Sora. 
I don't know what Sora's combo windows are like, actually. I imagine pretty big, because he's designed to auto-link so much, but... There it goes, right into an up smash. That's a laugh. Alright. Uh, did I fight Zora? I fought Zora. I uh, Zora. Sora. Oh, it doesn't matter, because Sora just lost. Never mind. Alright. What? Versus Bomba Dash. Let's bring it home. Let's, let's see what Muscle Butt can do. Uh, if you're in chat and you care to know, my moveset is the uh, Rapid Punch and the uh, Three, two, Soaring Axe Kick. Go! Suplex and uh, Faint Jump. That's, like, that's what every serious brawler has, is those two, though. Okay, that's not true. Some people... Some people are starting to use other... Uh, other side specials. Just immediately eating shit. Okay. Ugh. That would have been a great way to start end the first stock, wouldn't it? I just get that cheese kill. I should have gone for it. Okay, I'll take it. Earned! Come here. Come to my ledge. That was supposed to be a side beat. Just right in the cannonball. That is like a, a suction hitbox. You kind of get pulled into that explosion. Death. Death. Ah! I'm surprised the grab hitbox didn't come out. I don't think I'm going to win this. I'm not feeling confident. I'm still going to try, though. There's the grab hitbox. There's the grab armor. I have to start the grab before it comes out, though. No. Okay, I didn't blow up. It's not looking good. I would love to get my, uh, my rapid punch, my FMP. I don't, he's not gonna let me do it, though. Yes! 123. I can do this. That <sighs> guy's right into that. Okay. Uh, yes, it's an open arena. Feel free to hop in. Is Alex? Alex? Uh, exclamation ID for the arena code. Why are Morton's eyes so glossy? Oh, we got a full we got a full room though. You not might not be able to get in. You may have to uh, wait for an opening. Again, a lot of people today. Ready? 
We don't usually have this many. It's my turn. Are you the Game & Watch? I confused you with uh, one of my friends, Girly, Girly McGirlface, who also mains Falco and Wii Fit. Also a very skilled player. Game and Watch's up air is funny, but uh, it doesn't feel like it has nearly the win box of Mega Man's. Sadly. I like Mega Man. I would play him if this if we didn't have eight people in this era, in this arena, and if they weren't quite as skilled as they are. I'd be able to let loose a little more, but uh, by the look of things, I'm gonna have to stick to characters that I actually can play well. I play well. Mega Man's probably in my top. I think he's, he might be my number five. I main Bowser. I uh, sub Me Brawler and uh, I guess Ganon. I don't know what reason I'd have to bring out Ganon, but uh, I, I am competent with him. And uh, Me Gunner is my number four. I feel like Mega Man or Inkling are probably my number. Probably Mega Man is my number five. I like Inkling. I like Peach. I've been playing her since Melee, but uh, she's also way too technical for my dumb ass. So, uh, my Peach has fallen off as I've fought better and better players in this game. Game & Watch down throw will kill soon. Does he have a weak down throw, or is that his best throw? Quick, spam up B and dare. There's no counter. I like this fair. I don't care if it's useful or not. I just like going around dropping bombs on people. D throw is his best kill throw at around 200%. I see. That's not common, is it? D throw is being the kill throw. I guess it's Brawler's kill throw, too, though. Kind of. The closest thing he has to a kill throw. I don't, I don't know that for sure. Morton loves to edge guard with that uh, up special. At least he can still act after he goes out of it, unlike uh, unlike Lunar Launch. I like how he used the Fallen Cannonball to, to, uh, to punish the edge guard. Ooh! Side B goes right through the bomb. As happens. Bomb is a funny move, but it is a flimsy move. Oh, we do have a spot. Hello, weirdo.
All right, Peach versus Bombadash. I don't think we've seen this this match before. Sir Knight fought the Sora a few times. how complicated combos on Bowser Jr. are. If they change depending on which hitbox you hit of him. The, uh, the, the cart or the, or the, the Koopa. How do you guys think this game is doing? I've heard talk of, uh, you know, the hype is over. The community is starting to die down fewer and fewer players. Obviously, things like that recent, uh, that recent panda business don't help, but just aside from that, just like usually games tend to, uh, tend to drop off and play the base after a time. No news of any Smash 6. I'm still expecting one at some point in time, just because it would be a business decision. The series is too profitable not to make more of them. With or without Sakurai, with or without all the characters, probably won't be as good as this one. Which has me wondering if people are going to continue playing this one into the future. Or if maybe this will die down and people will... Uh, Just keep playing melee. People are gonna keep playing melee anyway, but uh, I'm curious if this one will have its own continuing fan base, player base. Just because it was probably the last Smash to have all of these characters in it. I was talking about games with uh, built-in randomizers earlier. Horomar is uh, on sale right now. It's one of the uh, one of the Pokemon knockoffs, spiritual spiritual successors tributes. Games made because the Pokemon company isn't really listening in a lot of ways, and uh, it has a built-in randomizer. It's sprite-based. It looks like it was made by fans of, like, black and white, that kind of thing. Shut up, Peach. I'm curious about it. Seems like uh, Coromon is kind of the uh, sprite-based Pokemon successor, and uh, Temtem is a more 3D kind of Pokemon knockoff. I might try uh, streaming Coromon once uh, we finish Black and White, which is the game that we are currently in the middle of streaming. Don't know why, but you remind me of a YouTuber called Choctopus. I am not familiar. However, I like chocolate and I like octopi, so I approve. Ready? I think I'm going to aim for uh, two runs per character. After my next loss with Muscle Butt, I will swap to Bowser. Three, two, one, Give it a crack go! with my name. See if I can beat some of these people. Ooh, immediate Ultra Turnip. Semi Smash YouTuber and Donkey Kong fanatic. That okay? That's that's Wickersham. 
the guy who, uh, who I usually play on streams of for Friday is also a, a huge Donkey Kong fan. Doing this this week because uh, he was not able to do his usual stream. Given the number of people showing up, though, I could uh, I could do Smash streams more often. I haven't done them in a very long while. We used to do them whenever a new character came out, and that was pretty much it. Jack kind of fell off of the game because uh, I, I think he just got tired of my shit. Tired of me doing stuff like that first stock I took on Morton. Ooh, that didn't quite kill. Come on, Lupus. I believe in the Lupus. Go off stage. You got a hammer. You got disjoint. Go smack her. Okay. Just a raw Gordo did it. Unless it was reflected by the turnip and then reflected back because he was still in the swing animation. I couldn't quite tell. Maybe that's what happened. Lupu's down another stock. This also doesn't seem like a great matchup just because of Peach's combo potential, but at least she doesn't have a Keyblade. She does have the crown. I don't remember how much of a disjoint the crown is. Also, it took me way too long to realize that that's what she was doing. Like, weaponizing her crown. I thought it was just a very hearty slap for the longest time. Ooh, up smash. Sorry, up tilt. Wasn't even a smash. 85 to 0. Can Lupus pull it back? Gets a Gordo, gets a Falling Nair. Mm, gets crowned. That's not good. You would think DDD would want to be crowned. She, Yes, she uses her crown for the fair. It's hard to see, right? There it is. We get a nice freeze frame. You can see the crown right there. Oh, you done, Lupus? Okay, well, thanks for joining. We'll see you later. Now, we just we got good players today, is all it is. I also didn't realize until someone pointed it out to me that uh, the ghost gym leader in Scarlet Violet, the uh, the rapper lady, her hair is a skeleton arm. I don't know how I didn't notice that. Ready? But I've heard apparently a lot of other people didn't notice it until it was pointed out either. Ooh, we got a peach ditto. Sir Knight versus Rylan. One, go! Ryland Reynolds. That was a weird... What, what taunt was that? The sweet. That was a very unpeach-like voice. Ooh. Crown towards the blast zone. Takes the first stock from Ryland. Ryland not getting a ton of hits on Sir Knight. I'll bet this is one of those players that uh, is not in Peach Cord, but if I went to Peach Cord, I would see a bunch of messages along the lines of, Hey, do any of you know a, you know a quick play player named Sir Knight? Umbrella reopen. Doesn't quite save her. Ryland, find, Ryland takes a stock. Bring 
Bring it back. Ooh. Air dodges the up smash, goes for her own up smash. I don't think either of these players are terrific at mixing up their recoveries. I'm gonna pass judgment, and then I'm gonna eat shit for it later, when uh, I, I am unable to kill them off stage. I say that. Okay, not not the case for Sir Knight. Sir Knight is using the float. Did the parasol reopening thing last stop? I guess I can't blame I can't blame uh, Lupus for not wanting to uh, pursue offstage. I do it every chance I get because I'm I'm a greedy bastard, and I think that's the most fun part of the game is the offstage play. Mmm! Back here, into the stage. Into the crowd. Yeah. Alright, once again, the rematch. Sir Knight's Peach versus Isolette's Sora? I'm gonna guess there's still Sora, given the icon. Y'all good? No, it's, uh, it's, they're Duck Hunt now. Actually, did, did, did Sir Knight start with Isolette? I don't remember. Dunt. Three, two, one, go! I need more matchup experience against Dunt. But I don't know how much I want it because he's an annoying character, like Steve, but not not as overpowering. Also, most of the time that I fight a against a dunt, it's as Bowser. And I always get hit by side beat, and I eat a, like a big follow-up move as a result. The frisbee is risky, but it's high reward if it does connect. First stock off of Sir Knight. Dunt actually doing great, comparatively. Only at 75% before that uh, that can. That crown, rather. The can might have saved him from the crown. Foot. I assume that was an accidental foot stomp. They usually are. Ooh. Landed the disc, didn't manage a follow up on it. What was that grab range? This is a silly match to watch. Peach. Baited an air dodge. I don't think he went for it, but still followed through the crown. I don't think Toad needed to be added to Peach's grabs. I don't know if that's a hot take. I think it's a little silly that Toad is just there for the grabs. Ooh. 
I forgot Duck Hunt can uh, can wall wall jump. I'm surprised he made it back up back from that. So Dunt won. Not looking forward to this. I will do my best. I am a character who is reasonably equipped. I have a rushdown character versus a projectile character. I'm still expecting to get, like, read like a book. Ready? I'm gonna eat so many cans. Let's see how this goes. Muscle butt versus Dunt. Again, my after my next loss, I will. Uh, I'll be changing characters. Ow! And I'd like to get in and do something. He's not going to let me. Hey, I hit him with his own can. That counts as something. Just eating those over and over again. That's not good. Ah! I should I should have suicided. I should have taken both of us. Unfortunately, I can't just kind of run in because of the, the frisbee. I land on shield is basically unpunishable. Let me just jump into that. That's a good idea. A little more damage. I don't know if he's quite at kill percent yet. my neutral special specifically. I didn't even see what I got hit by. I'll just run up and I'll punch him. That's what I'll do. I'm going to switch to Bowser, so please do not start the next match, or it will not be on stream.
I like to think my win rate with Brawler is about on par with Bowser and Ganon. However, it's very cheesy. I'm not a technical brawler, and a good brawler has to be technical. I get a lot off of matchup inexperience, wins that I probably don't deserve. I'm also old. I can't do these reactions that these, these crazy kids are doing these days. I gotta play the fatties and try my best. Mm. That was a little hard to watch. Maybe Beerus is on the down mode. Iso seems like a player that laps a lot. It seems, it seems like you would almost have to for Duck Hunt. Also surprised by uh, the distance that he's uh, recovering from repeatedly. Alright, well, while this is going on, I am going to make a quick coffee. Is this a team? Are these players back to back, girl boss and feminism? Weird coincidence, if not. Is this the game plan? Just hang back and then the side beat warp in. I guess it works. Is immune to uh, immune to projectiles while doing that, right? It makes sense, I say, but in practice, I don't know if Girl Boss has this. hard to kill Duck Hunt. Eh, it's a zoner. It's a, it's a very powerful zoner character. Or a character with very powerful zoning, I should say.
there aren't a lot of characters like that in this game. There are a lot of zoners, but, uh, like, the purest zoners are the ones that just don't need to get close, period. They can do everything from afar. They can deal their damage, and they can kill. Which is just... what? Duck Hunt, Me Gunner, arguably Samus. Samus has charge shot, but she needs... She needs, like, set up for that. She can't just fire a charge shot from across the stage. And she can if the opponent drops her controller, I suppose. Hello, Catadoc. Belmonts can do more or less everything from a distance. They can't do it that well from a distance, but uh, they're never forced to approach, I should say. Like, Falco can cover long distance with his blaster. He can force the opponent to approach. But he is all also himself forced to approach if he ever wants to kill, because obviously Blaster's not going to kill. Greninja did get one stock while I wasn't looking. Just got Duck Hunt from random. How's your Duck Hunt, Elf? I can sort of play them, but not, not really. Duck Hunt is in my, I don't know, bottom 40%. I like playing him. I, I, I kind of like playing him, too, just because he's, it, it's fun and dumb to, like, just kick the can around everywhere. You need a multi-thread processor, though. And I, I don't know if I have quite enough threads for Duck Hunt. Ready? One of those, like, uh, one of those stage management characters. Oh, uh, Whipper's here. Hello, Whipper. I also see Elf King in the arena now. We haven't gotten any players with, like, awful connections Three, two, since, uh, one, the couple we have. Go! I, I think we've I think we filtered them out. Is the peach still here? Do we still have a Sir Knight? Bowser Jr. is a pure zoner because he can just stand back and cannonball and get kills. That, that's that, that, that is akin to the Samus standing back and just expecting charge shot to hit. She can't do that. Can is another projectile that can be used against the dog, similar to Gordo, but uh, unlike Gordo, Duck Hunt has pretty much constant control over it, so... I wonder how Gordo could be conceived, conceivably reworked in order to fix its uh, crippling weaknesses. It's still a useful projectile on it. It's not a move that's just, like, not worth using. But it, 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 it's very exploitable. Everyone never knows this. Bombadash drilling that can, eating his own magic koopa. This is a very uneven match between projectile users. 
Poor Morton can't compete. Oh, that's right. Duck Hunt can uh, can act after their. Can they act after up special? He air dodged. Is it one of those ones that you can buffer an action afterwards and that's it? I didn't know he could air dodge after up special. I could have sworn to trigger a free fall. Tall order can bomb can bomba dash get at least one more stock. What time is it? It is almost one o'clock. I'll probably go at least another hour. I'm gonna aim for a three-hour stream. Ooh, it's not enough, unfortunately. Air dodge or throw out a move. Okay, so it is one of those weird ones that you can buffer an action after the end of the... That's bizarre. Because usually in cases like that, like uh, Me Sword Fighter's Airborne Assault, if you buffer an action, you don't go into free fall. Well, I guess I don't know if that's the case with, with uh, Duck Hunt either, though. So, can he... Up special, buffer an attack, and then not go into free fall. He's free to jump again. Granted, you'd lose height because you had to buffer an attack to, to do that, but... Alright, Isolette versus Whipper. Ready? Anything after up B? You buffer a jump after up B if you still have your air jump? I don't know why you wouldn't necessarily. A slight mix up, but. Three, two, one, go! Alright, Whipper's got this. The K Rule God. It's okay. Still got this. This is warming up. Yeah, I'll admit it. Duck Hunt is a character I don't enjoy fighting. Uh, what are you doing, Alf? Are you on random? Mm. Optimistic Dare, trying to go through the uh, K-Rule. One good hit. Oh, he's not gonna get it. The monumental task of approaching Duck Hunt while that can is out. But you have to go from the air, or you'll just get the you'll get the frisbee. But the air is the can's domain. Wait, he can do that? How long can he do that for? That's like some K rule up air shit. Hello, Creeper. Creeper? Is it a Creeper made of crepes? A Creeper. I can go for a Creeper. Whipper is really struggling to get that damage in. Oh, what was that? He missed the sweet spot.
still alive. 167. Oh, he doesn't have his crown. Kick the can. Yeah, you show him. You kick that dog. Is he going for a down smash on ledge? Is he trying to two frame with that? Oh, the crown. Who did Isolette start with? I remember I fought. I think I fought them. Did they beat did they beat Sir Knight? Feminism is new. Ready? Maybe feminism has this. Maybe they're gonna be the one to take down uh ISO. D-pad is too close to the joystick. What do you use, Whipper? Three, use GameCube? Two, one, go! Just a uh, neutral B encounter. What an irony that feminism is playing such a privileged character. Sorry, yet. I just live with docked Joy-Cons. Can't be bothered to have controller doubt anymore? I don't know what that has to do with docked Joy-Cons, but I'm sorry that you're using docked Joy-Cons. I'm surprised that didn't set off the can. I thought fire attacks made it explode immediately. Stop I bought a uh, an old Logitech PC controller recently because I was sick of my Xbox One controller disconnecting. This one doesn't, so it solved that problem. It's just uh, not as comfortable a, a controller, so. Uh, uh, I'm talking about PC games, not Smash. So I kind of have the lesser of two evils, where uh, I can either have the Playmobil controller that is certain not to disconnect while I'm playing, or I can have the decent controller that will likely disconnect while I'm playing. No one knows how to make controllers anymore. For Smash, I use a GameCube controller from uh, 2002, back when people did know how to make controllers. Tried Pro Cons. Unfortunately, both of mine came out of the box with the uh, flip back, so I have a not a good history with Pro Cons. This is one of the closer matches so far. Maybe she will take out the... Maybe she will take out Iso's Dunt. Zero. Final stock. I'm rooting for feminism. I respect Iso's duck hunt, I just don't want to have to fight it. I, 
th I would rather fight the power. Yeah. Keep him coming. Explode him. Explode the dog. Oh, no, no, no! Oh! I'm surprised she couldn't recover from that. If she was at a reasonable percent, I suppose, but... It's not a strong spike, Duck Hunt Dare, right? Okay. If you did fight Sir Knight before, it would be t it's time to go back. I don't... I don't remember. I know I definitely fought Iso. Okay, well, if Iso wins this match, then it'll be time to cycle the line. I feel like with Duck Hunt, you're at least not getting comboed too heavily unless you fall for setups or get Frisbee chained. But I, I do both of those things. That's the problem. Like I said, it's kind of hard to figure out an approach option because the ground is covered by Frisbee and the air is covered by Can. I, I guess I just have to fall back on the old, uh, the old default. Walk slowly and shield. I, ju I can't rush in. Unfortunately, because the Frisbee is like a multi-hit, or rather, it's not dependent on hitting the opponent, Duck Hunt activates it manually. Even if I shield the Frisbee, he can still fire all three shots and uh, eat up my time to punish his use of Frisbee. Like, just because I shield it doesn't mean I can punish him using it, right? It is a matchup I want to get better at. Although, were this a bracket situation, I would probably still be on Bowser. I don't think this is a character that I would feel the need to change for. There are some like uh, Sword Fighters and uh, Pikachu. I tend to switch off Bowser for. Although, Brawler also struggles with sword fighters, so... I was trying to get my gunner up to a point that, uh... He could deal with sorties. I don't know if I can say that I have or not. Mm. Sir Knight is serious now. He might be going for the footstools. I don't know, that one looked like he, he went for the same thing a second time. Oh, was that an ultra? That might have been a stitch face. Come on, Peach. The dunt must be dethroned. It's time to put old Yeller down. It's kind of hard to intrinsically know which way the can is facing. You really just have to pay attention to it at all times. Which I guess goes without saying when you're fighting or playing Duck Hunt. Alright. Cross counter! Impressive dunt. Impressive play. That's everyone in the arena. So, uh, ISO. Back up, back to the back.
Let's give uh, some non-duck hunts a chance to play until you get get back to the front, and then you'll probably do another eight-person win. That was the last one. No, you fought me already. I fought your duck hunt. I was the I was the brawler. Oh, you done? Alright, well, good having you regardless. Thank you for playing ISO. Alright, Elf King. Three, two, one, Certainly a better player than I. However, I am my main, and I don't know how Elf King's K rule is. So, uh, this could be close. Maybe. That was greedy. I shouldn't have done that. <laughs> Died at zero. Man. And of course we're on cave, so I can't do my, uh... I can't do my Bowser Bomb shenanigans. This isn't good. And I, I went too low again. I'm not making myself look good in this stream. I swear, I'm, I usually play better than this. You guys believe me, right? Alright. I, I was rusty. I'm gonna pull it back. This is the moment. I got his crown. Yeah, what now, elf? Now I'm double king. King of the Koopas and the Kremlings. What are you gonna do about it? Ah! That would have been cool. GG, Elf. I would have won if I hadn't lost. Elf v. Girl Boss. It was, it was Whipper playing. Whipper was playing K. Rule. If Elf can only defeat Girl Boss, we'll have a K Rule Ditto versus GameCube and I guess Joy Cons. I know there are uh, much more complicated Smash Arena streams where the streamer has, like, uh, they have a bot to queue up matches and things like that. That's also arenas that, like, only the streamer plays, though, right? Every match is against the streamer. And I'm, I'm not good enough for people to want to do that. Better do something like this. More people get to play. Ooh, two frame. Someone got paid to go into the uh, go into the recording booth 
and make these uh, these throat noises. These are Vinny noises. <laughs> I just that just occurred to me. Greninja is just it's Scoop. Elf, you notice that? It's the same fucking voice. Can I voice Greninja? I can do it. Elf, give him the D smash. You know you want to. Girl boss just can't get a break. All right, K rule ditto. Let's do this. Cyan versus Magenta. Battle of the Printer Toners. If only we had a yellow K rule. I kind of wish there was a way for K rule to grab his own, own crown as a throwing item. I like throwing items. I wish more characters had them. Peach's turnips are like the reason I enjoy the character. Young Link's bombs are pretty fun. Unfortunately, they explode, so you can't uh, you can't like combo on them multiple times. Fairly even so far. Whipper with the advantage. Whipper being, I know, a skilled player and also a capable main, whereas uh, just one of Elf's many pockets. I did suddenly start doing better against Whipper, like, one day. I'm wondering if that is the day that the Joy-Cons happened. Could I pin down the day that he started using me? Alright, one for one. Stock two. Pretty even. Perfectly even. Y'all gotta play D-Smash Chicken. It's every K. Rule's favorite pastime. Hello, Omni. Welcome to the stream. We have a little space in the arena if you would like to join. I don't remember if you're still, uh... Are you, are you playing? Shame we haven't seen a Kongus today. He usually joins for the uh, Smash streams. The Shara mod. Smash Brothers Ultimate, but every single item is pick upable. Those cannonballs that bounce off and land on the floor, you can pick them up. Just run around with them. That would be kind of funny for a Me Brawler shot put. Especially since that happens so often. It loses its hitbox and just kind of lands flaccidly on the floor. I believe in you, Whipper. 
I'm only rooting for you because of the joy the joy cons. Grab doesn't connect. Command grab also doesn't connect. Crown doesn't save him. Elf is playing very carefully. He's bringing it back. Oh, there he goes. No, that was Elf who connected. Elf at 175% wins the match. He just couldn't get that last stock. Alright, can Kung Fu dethrone Elf's K rule? We have another Belmont. Another Simon, specifically. I wonder if the popularity has changed. I felt like I saw mostly Richters when the when the game came out. People more excited to play as Richter than Simon. That was also, I think, this game predates the Castlevania anime, doesn't it? I also don't know who was in that. I know Alucard was. It was based off, like, Symphony of the Night, wasn't it? Based. Very loosely based. What an ironic name to be named Kung Fu and to be playing a projectile equipment character. F Tilt takes his first stop. Another stock just from gimping. Maybe Kung Fu actually means Ryu. Maybe it still begs the question of why they're playing a uh, why they're playing K rule. Sorry, uh, Belmont. Three stocks in the favor of Elf King. All right, Sir Knight returns. Ultra Peach versus Elf King's K rule. Has Briley played yet? I think Briley and Clai Shi have not uh, been in the ring yet. Three, two, one, go! that the percentage matters more for Peach than, uh, than K. Rule, because he's heavy. But it's so free and so easy for Peach to pursue offstage and not get punished for it that uh, a lot of Sir Knight's kills have been just pursuing towards the blast zone. That Nair, though. I always hear Peach players telling me that the Nair is amazing. I just, I don't use it enough. I need to figure out how to how to use it while falling, instead of using it there. 
Ooh, ooh, I don't like that. There for days. K. Rule, just all of his attacks getting interrupted. There's, there's a kill. All right, Elf King at 88 versus Sir Knight. Fresh stock. How did, how did that crown not hit? Oh, the throw, the throw in, invincibility. Ooh, the crown. It, it is, it is also very difficult for K. Rule to discover. Uh, discover. It is very difficult for K. Rule to discover against Peach because of her vegetables. Recovery weaknesses, attacks from the side, and uh, projectiles, and Peach has both. Ooh, what was- was that a side B? She used, like, the auto-activation of Peach Bomb to avoid the dare. Elf, I believe in you. I would have gone for an up air there. Maybe, maybe that was, uh, maybe that was unsafe. Yeah, F tilt. Yeah. All right. He's at the funny number. He's gonna win. Never mind. He lost the funny number. Oh no. That's a bad place to be. He made it to. He made it to ledge just to get up smashed for a neutral get up. All right, Sir Knight is once again in charge. Let's try this now. The last time I fought, I think the only time I fought Sir Knight was with my Ganon. It was very delayed, but it was still a reasonably close match. Let's see if I can take her with my, uh, with my main, with my Bowser. I'm gonna I'm gonna preload my uh, pre-match John. My audio is desynced. I play with like a I because I'm streaming. I'm playing with like a second delay audio. So I'm ready to fire that when I inevitably lose this. Say that. Ow. Oh, all that interrupted dare! I didn't expect that. Also gotta stop mashing attack to get up. That's a very bad habit. I'm gonna get punished for that hard. I know my habits, I'm just bad at breaking them. No, you come here. Uh-oh. Oh, what was that? Oh. She dumped she jumped the uh, flying slam. She dumped the flying slam. No. I did I didn't even hit ledge like I intended to, but you know what it worked. That's that. That's a bad idea against this Peach. I can't get away with Bowser Bomb except to ledge. Bowser Bomb is not a move that you use against good players and don't get punished for. Oh. Also, you know what? I shouldn't be approaching unless I really have to. Unfortunately, right now I have to. I don't. No, you come to me. Ooh, she came to me. No one expects the Bowser Inquisition. Missed my 
fair. And I got crowned. It's alright. Still in the lead. I don't technically have to approach. I almost buffered a dare. That would have been very bad. I would like some fire breath damage. I don't think I'm going to get it. I'm now in the... Okay. In the lead again. I'm gonna play footsies a little bit. And be careful. I'm gonna not jump into turnips. I'm gonna cut turnips. Bowser is an excellent cook. And I ate. Ate the poo poo. <sighs> yes! Ugh. I should have grabbed. I should have side bead. Close game. No, nope. I shouldn't have air dodged. Come here. Oh. Oh, she knows her ledge positioning. <sighs> I should have air dodged. I didn't think that was going to kill me. I thought I had just barely survived that. Shut up, Peach. Why are you such a bitch? Why you got to be so mean? The meanest, rudest Smash character. GG. Alright, uh, oh, don't start. Sorry, I'm gonna change. Okay, it's too late. That's okay. We're, we're gonna miss one of the matches. I will try, against my better judgment, I will try Gunner. I don't think we're gonna see this match. I can do. Yeah. Let's play some Agario. Ooh. Yeah, this is the gameplay you come for. This is the real stream. You guys don't want to watch Smash. I gotta watch my disadvantaged state. I don't want any of these other dots to use a uh, use a burst movement on me. I can't quite see chat. I think someone is uh, recounting it to me. Here, Peach just killed Link off the top with Paris again. She's been doing that a lot. She has enjoyed doing that throughout the day. I, I, I respect that. I think uh, up, up special kills off the top are funny. It's high risk, high reward. Hype, as the kids say. Get away, Wonder Woman. video game animation. That's right. Did you know you can play any character in this game? Literally, any character that exists in the history of creation. You just gotta upload a PNG. I think. I think you can do that. Oh. Oh no. The match is over. The next one's starting. But I'm still gaming. Alright. Who left? Was that uh, Elf King lost? No, who it wasn't Elf King fighting. Who was fighting? It was the it was the Link. I don't remember who the Link was. Three, two, 
One, go! Corn? We have peach versus corn. Fruits or vegetables, which do you prefer? The link was very bad, I see. It's probably just someone who's drawing for fun. We probably got better players than usual because I set the arena to glorious smashers. I think uh, I think Wicker sets his to so like everyone welcome or one of those kind of options. I feel like I should set it to that so that people know what to expect when they join the arena. I guess I guess that link did not. Yeah. Trollbot's doing better than previous performances. Maybe Peach just doesn't have a core and matchup experience, though. Imagine if Peach's dare spiked. How busted that would be. Although I guess it would also lose its combo combo utility, so... Uh, that's like the most potent part of it, is that it can be used on stage. I like how her down throw is just Toad using a, a much shittier head-on assault. She should be able to do that next to ledge and uh, set Toad spiraling down, carrying the opponent like head-on assault. That would be fair and balanced. Would be even better as a combo tool. Yeah, maybe. Ganon's dare is technically able to combo into some things. That's like the strongest spike in the game. Close to it. Uh, Kazuya has a stronger one, doesn't he? A stronger spike than Ganon's? I remember Ganon's was dethroned at some point. Second strong is behind Violet. Okay. That makes sense. Big axe. Whiz kick spike is still strongest. Are there any combos that like lead into whiz pick whiz kick spike that are like true? I know Ganon is not a combo character. Does Yoshi's Dare technically spike? Does it have a weak spike at the end? That's a silly day. I like I like using Yoshi's Dare. Hello, Victoria. Dare footstool whiz kick. Okay, that's on stage though. Right? That's not gonna like the whiz kick spike isn't gonna spike someone off stage with that. <laughs> Using Bowser Bomb at ledge is one of my favorite Three, things two, because uh one, go. it either ledge trumps or uh, if if they panic and jump into it, then it, that that's what spikes them. If you do it right, the look of the ledge very impractical. Right? Yeah. Uh, that looked like just the right distance for him to not make it back. What is this music? It doesn't sound like Peach versus K roll music, that's for sure. Uh, I watched a Did You Know Gaming on Majora's Mask today. 
which they have several that have done that game many times before, because there's just, there's a lot to study in that game. It's a fascinating game. And uh, apparently the style of music in Majora's Mask was inspired by Chinese opera. Interesting little tidbit. Things are not looking good for Whipper. 98 to 13. Text the, text the stage spike. Could he get possibly get one more kill? He's at 146%. Okay, we take those. Unfortunately, it's not really possible for uh, K. Rule to, like, suicide with his, his suck. He's actually the one that, uh, well, he, he dies first if they go in the blast zone together, I believe, but, uh, if a K. Rule attempts that, I usually just jump in at such a point that I will be automatically launched out before he hits the blast zone. Who did Sir Knight start with? Was it Kung Fu? Okay, see you later, Whipper. Started on Elf, okay. Y'all good to go? We just gonna sit here? Am I gonna play Agario? There they go. Sometimes both players are, like, so polite they get the mindset of, no, I'm not going to start, I'm going to wait for the other two, person to start. One, and then go. we get a, a Canadian argument, and just, the match never starts. Honestly, rather than adding Toad to her grabs, I think I would have rather that Toad was replaced from her, her counter. Because what the hell is that move? She, she uses a Toad as a sacrifice? That's not cool. That's kind of like a fucked up move idea to, to begin with. That, what was that? Did, did, there was a dare hitbox from her head? I'm going to be going about another 20 or 30 minutes. I'm glad Sir Knight has been with us this whole time. We're a skilled but not annoying player. Man, I, I can't, I can't watch Captain Falcon's recovery and just the amount of drift he gets afterwards and, and not feel self-conscious as a Ganon. It's so fluid. It's like he's actually flying. line up because I'm on a delay. Alright. Return of the Belmont. Belmont take three. 
I think we did this match before. And uh, Kung Fu struggled to keep Sir Knight off of him. Unless I'm thinking of another match. Maybe that was the... Maybe that was Dunt. This ult, the animation makes it look like Toad is protecting her. Yeah, but still... Peach has also gotten, like, meaner over the course of, uh, of Smash's life. Like, she was pretty, she was pretty nondescript in Melee. I think Brawl. I don't remember which game added, which game added the four, the three taunts. Was that Brawl? At some point, she got the, the, the very taunting dance. In four, she got, oh, did I win? Which at least kind of sounds like a question. In this game, they went full on. Like, she's clearly making fun of you. She's insulting you for having lost to her. Peach has gotten just progressively meaner. And yet the toads are now more willing than ever to protect her. That this is a this is a girl boss moment. Peach is selling bath water to these simp toads. I do kind of love it though. Like she's so she's so unapologetically mean in this game that it makes her fun to play as. I had to stop playing Peach and start playing Daisy because Peach made Jack too angry. Unsurprisingly, Peach is winning. Kung Fu has taken a stock. Could get another one. Ooh, that might be it for Belmont. Makes it back. Stop throwing stuff out. No, play patient. Okay, got another kill. 103 to 0. Yeah, it's sarcastic in this game. It wasn't sarcastic in 4. At least not as obviously so. Alright, another win for Sir Knight. Alright, I believe that's the line, so uh, Sir Knight, if you're listening, it's time to rotate to the back. Peachy. Theory, I have strengths. Do you want to? Do you want to? You uh, do you want to try it? If you want to fight Sir Knight, I won't stop you. And she's supposed to rotate to the back now. Hello, excess. Admittedly, I kind of want to rematch with her as Bowser too, though. So. Maybe I'll wait until after I lose to kick her and look, like, extra salty as a result because I don't think she's watching the stream. Ooh! Oh, no! Well, what's she gonna do with that? She can start a combo, but, uh, he was at 0%, so... What an unfortunate Mr. Saturn appearance. Smash. Ass into explosion. What is this? This is Donkey Kong, right? 
can't quite hear it. It's kind of it's kind of low. This particular music track. Ooh, ooh. Oh no! Elf escaped, but at what cost? Okay, he made it. Nope, up B doesn't quite kill. I wish that... I, I don't think that uh, Ridley can, like, dare to ledge like Bowser can Bowser bomb. I kind of wish he could. That would be silly. Just throw out, a, throw out a smash attack. See if she'll go ass first into it again. Okay. Worthy trade, I suppose. One to one. Final stock. Elf is at heart a Ganon main, so I know he knows how to read habits. I have faith in him. I believe he can capitalize on the Peach and pull ahead. It's really, it's really not subtle. The way Peach's attacks are like hearts on her ass, is it? Alright, I will make one more attempt on, on Peach. See you later, Elf. And if I lose, I will expect Sir Knight to go to the back, and if they don't, then I will kick them. And then we'll probably do one more cycle before closing the arena. Oh, I'm Gunner. I'm not Bowser anymore. This is gonna go poorly. I'll try it, because I said I would. I'm gonna get three stocked. I'm Larry. This controller, the R button feels off. Sorry, let me get my Johns in. Oh, right into the up, up smash. That's a weird me. He's Kuroshi. No, I was out of grab range. One down. 90%. Not great. Ooh. Nope. Dead. I'm not teching at all. I should be teching these. There's that reaction time again. That old man reaction time. Just floats over at a smash. Turnips. No turnips allowed. I guess she can just drop into crown. I didn't actually know you could do that. Alright, Sir Knight. That's a cycle and then some. So, uh, back of the line.
I'm gonna switch to uh, I'm gonna switch to Bowser again. Try to go out with a bang. I'm, I'm sorry, did she leave at the last second? I didn't see. We're only going to be going for another 10 minutes or so anyway. We will go until my next match. So whoever's in the arena when I get there, I, I will be the final boss. I will be the, the, the baby easy final boss of the stream be my Bowser. I had to do some shuffling around in the arena. Oh, there's ads on Agario now? That didn't sound good. That wasn't a good place to cut off that ad. This one's going on a while. Girl Boss versus Kung Fu. My shoot button is. I think it's like spacebar. Try S. No, I, I don't have my keyboard on me. I just have my mouse. That's okay. Go away, fly. Hey, listen. Be sure to tune in for the Ocarina of Time Randomizer next week. That's probably the plan. I'll probably do that in the middle of the week. Uh, I don't know what I will... Maybe I'll do something with Jack this weekend. He's off weekends. Oh no, I'm near the biggest player, aren't I? Are y'all just standing across from each other? What are you doing? Surely it's almost over by now. Corin one. Okay, there we go. Weirdo. Who's Weirdo? Is, is Weirdo Kung Fu? All 
Alright, good luck, Charizard King. Are, are you a solo Zard? If so, I wonder if you will be given time to change, to, uh, change Mons. How merciful is Girl Boss? Go for it, Three, two, one, go! Pokemon Scarlet Violet currently having a Cinderace raid. Okay. I am woefully unprepared for. Throw out Flare Blitz while Corrin is stuck in the ground. Logically, Corrin should have a type advantage. F throw. First kill. Alright, one for one. some uh, Xenoblade music going on. This is the weirdest Monster Hunter stream I've ever watched. You getting some stutter? You guys good? Looks good now. Charizard used Flamethrower. It's not very effective. That's actually a four times type weakness, assuming Corrin would be Water Dragon. Good luck with Ocarina of Time. I am going to be trying the uh, 60 FPS PC port with a built-in randomizer. I do an Ocarina randomizer every winter, and I do a Majora randomizer every summer. And uh, this winter, I'm trying the 60 FPS Ocarina randomizer. Probably do something wacky, like uh, it randomize entrances too, just for something different. He recovered from Flare Blitz in time to make it back to stage. That didn't quite kill. Ooh. Up air for the kill. Girl boss at 101%. Dishonor Brew. And Fair decides it. Pokemon trainer. You all did great. Yeah, Ash catch him. It's not Ash. It actually sounds worse than Ash, which is impressive because Ash does not have a nice sounding voice. Sorry if you like Ash's voice. I like Veronica Taylor. I don't remember which era of Ash she voiced. Voiced. Yeah, voiced. that my next match will be the final match. Alright, what is this brawler's move set? I'm going to judge them fiercely if they don't have faint jump. Just uh, hopping up there, trying to get Charizard to come to them. Can't really do that in bracket though because they're losing the damage race. Like if the clock runs out like this, they lose. Victoria has not used any specials yet. Perhaps it's the mythical 0000, zero, zero, zero brawler. The brawler with no special moves. I kinda wish you could do that. Just for the lulls. I want a I want a zero 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 brawler. I 
I think she, she's really doing it. She's really determined not to use specials. I guess. Just kind of walking around grabbing is all she's doing. Is she role-playing? She is very much acting like a multi-me smash me. Okay, once again, Victoria determined not to approach, which she can't really do because if the time runs out like that, she loses. When at a percentage disadvantage, she has no other option but to approach her opponent. I'm assuming a smart opponent, that is. I guess you could still hang back and just hope that your opponent is, like, impatient. Inadvisable. Not much normals, though, either. Yeah, true. Again. So far, just jumps and grabs. Even in that situation, she did not up special. Does she not have the special button bound? Does she not have the A button bound? Does she only have jump and grab? Oh, she nared. Charizard, you can't lose a stock to this person. What are you doing? You're the king! I'm so confused by this match. This is our penultimate match. Okay, good me. Solid play from all parties. You took a stock off your opponent, and that's all anyone can ask for. Alright, final match. Sorry, Juice. I'm afraid you arrived to the stream too late. We've been going over three hours, so we were just about to call it. Final match, Charizard versus Bowser. Normally, I'm not a merciful player. However, I will allow you to go Zard. Alright, dragon go. battle. Ow. Cut that out. Mine's better. That grab range, though. It's not very effective. Would have been a cool grab to hit. Yeah, shield it. Oh! Oh, that didn't break it! Get grabbed. It's alright. I'm Bowser. I can look through that. Come here. Come to my ledge. Thank you. Give him the old yonky spoinky. First stock, 153. Right, I'm gonna let him switch. I'll be nice. No, you come to me. I don't need to approach. Thank you. Oh, I got greedy. I tried to. I shouldn't have tried to charge it. Jump. Come on, jump into my fire. Why you no jump? You know, in, in bracket, I win this situation, right? I can just stand here for five minutes. I get in the most technical sense this isn't bracket. The game will put us into sudden death, but... You'll know who really won. Ugh. Come on, 
Flare Blitz. I know you want to. I know you're waiting for it. Okay, that's one way to do it. What, why, do, why do people do that with the leaf? Is it just like a timing thing? It just lets you know how long you have before you can switch to Charizard? Predicted that, and that. I gotta stop daring. I can't get away with it. Yeah. Use Flare Blitz again. I dare you. Come on, one more time. Let's get grabbed. G. Well, that's the Smash stream for the day. Once again, sorry to that one person who didn't get to play. GG's to everyone involved. We had a lot of people today. Thank you, everyone, for coming. And uh, maybe I'll do this again sometime. I was surprised by the number of people we had. It was nice to have people to uh, play the game with. So, uh, maybe a future Smash stream. Might do something with Jack this weekend. We'll probably be doing uh, Ocarina of Time Randomizer next week. Next week. So, uh, come watch that. And I'll see you guys later.